Hello everyone, welcome back to Knock Knock. Okay, is it dark in your room? Have you turned out the lights? I haven't, let me do that right now. There we go. Now it's dark. God, this game is so incredibly atmospheric, isn't it? Playing this in the dark? In this menu here, just looking out at the woods, listening to the crickets? Ugh. Okay. Oh, what what fresh horrors await me? Let's find out. Continue. Alright, so that bar's about halfway gone, so I need to be quick. And the house is freaking huge now. So many rooms. I was wrong. They didn't come from inside. They are the real guests. My mind tricked me. I should have imagined them as something different. But now it is too late. Right, some of the notes said like what you imagine becomes true, right? So he imagined them wrong and made them... Made the wrong things true. Is that what he's saying? Well, so far everything's quiet. Nice and quiet. What? <laughs> Who is that crying and where are they? Also, I just realized the monster's gone. For now. Where is it? I don't I, I can't wait. I got to go. Where is that crying coming from? It's not up here, is it? Is it coming from everywhere? Remember, remember. Come on. Oh, okay. Wait a minute, that's like, um... He said he remembered, a, he remembered like a child being here, right? Someone small? That looks like drawings from a child. Look at that, it looks like they were crossing off the days? What the hell? Oh wait, I didn't, I didn't turn it off. Oh god. Okay. Come on. Where to now? Been left. Okay, time to go down. Where is that crying coming from? Oh god. Okay. Is there something in here? No. Where is that crying coming from? What? Don't do this. Don't tell me what to do. It sounds like the crying is coming from everywhere. Okay, I need to unlock this. I need... Oh. That is a spirit. Let me unlock this. And let me go up. You trust yourself. Oh, no, I haven't. Let it go. Let it go. Oh, God, there's something else. Okay. And... And we're off. Come on. Come on. See if I can get this light up before it comes back. Oh, great. That's a lot. Okay. No, I don't think I can. Remember? No, no. Just go down. Just go down. Okay. Don't do this. What is that sound? The fuck is that sound? Okay, clock. Good. What is that sound? I, I don't even know. It also sounds like it's coming from everywhere. Alright, where's that ghost? Okay, remember. Reme oh, it's down below there. It's a... Bed? Hold on, was that a bed? Oh, oh, God, I didn't think it was that close. It just appeared right in front of me. Crap. It went through the wall. Do not... What? Oh, the spirit was right above me and I didn't see it. Okay, I just restarted the day. Dang it. Okay, let's go. God, we gotta be fast. Look, look at that bar. Now it's like 70... F maybe 70% 70 gone? Gotta be fast. 
No, no, no. I'm only imagining this. This is caused by my persistent insomnia. I have to fall asleep. Okay, come on. Come on. Let's try this again, but without doing stupid things. Alright, I don't think there's a clock up there. I'm assuming the rooms are the same. But there was a clock somewhere down here. I don't remember exactly where. Oh, I meant to fix the light, actually. There's the crying again. Right, nothing in here. Where was the clock, exactly? I think it was to the left. Two rooms to the left and then down. Right? I think it was. Wait a minute, is that what I see to my left? Do I see someone huddled down crying? Is that the person crying? I, I can't tell. I guess I'll get there soon. I can't wait. I think it is. Oh, hi. Look at that thing up there. I'm gonna stop looking at it now. There's a head in a ball of leaves. Okay, there should be a clock down here, I think. No, okay, damn, it's randomized. What the fuck? Yeah, that is a woman right there. Okay. Wait, he's remembering something. Okay. Where's that ghost? I know it's here, but I don't see it. I keep zooming out. No need. Wait, there's me. There's a, there's a copy of me to the left, all the way to the left. Stay in the light, and I'll be fine. Okay, I can't get. Wait, how do I get to there? Thought about it. And right then. It whoa! whoa. <laughs> Seriously? I thought I thought he couldn't come in the light. I guess I was wrong. Never mind. Shit. This is really hard, and that bar is getting really freaking low. This is not good. Oh my god. What happens when it does that? Oh no you don't. You won't deceive me with your tricks. I'm an empirical man. I know how the world works. My own mind is testing me. Voices in my head? I'm not listening. Did I glimpse something moving in the corner? I'm not looking. Well it's an admirable, um, outlook. But I'm afraid it's not going to work. All right, well, since everything, even the items seem to, be randomi seem to be randomized, so there could potentially be a clock in these areas, even though I've been here before. So let's just look everywhere again. Once again. Just this time without dying. That sounds pretty good, huh? Do the same thing, but don't die. Oh, she's in a different room. Actually, she's totally down below. What was... I think I just saw a creature, but it disappeared in the light, thank god. Is there something else here? Yes, there's something else here. Oh, yes. Oh, whoa. This is new. Hide and seek. It's not just a game. It's a way of life. No matter where or how you hide, time will always run backwards. Because... <laughs> and the rest is missing. Because, and then it just ends. Yep, no matter where or how you hide, time will always run backwards. Indeed it does. <laughs> how do I get there? Ooh, another clock. Good. And it starts again. I 
and now I'm locked in here. I'm just gonna unlock this, thank you. And I'm gonna stay right here at the ladder. The ladder is my safe point. Let's turn this off. I hear you oh, and there it comes. Let me see if I can get this unlocked before it comes. Come on, come on. Nope. Okay. I need to wait. I just need to wait for it. Wait for it to go back so I can unlock the door. Wait, did it disappear or is it coming back the other way? What is it doing? I'm not gonna... Oh, shit, there's another one. I'm right here. Oh, God. I'm going down. Do not... Just keep a lookout. Look around you. I'm actually pretty close to daylight. Oh! Wait, I hear the handprints. Handprints, where are they coming from? I'm going down. It knows where you are. Does it? I see it. I, they're coming. Turn that off. It is coming closer. Come on, please go to the side. If it finds you, you win. Okay, no, I'm not turning on that light. Where is it? Where's it going? Where's it going? It's going back, I think. Come on. The woman is right behind this door. No, it's right above me. Where is it going? Is it going back and forth? Do I want to see what... No, I'm, I'm not going to the crying woman. No. <gasps> Shit. 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 Can you hear me coming? Where is it? I'm going up. It's, it's coming towards me. I'm going up. Oh, fuck. It's a closed room. Oh, no. Oh, fuck. If it comes up here, I'm going down. I just need to last like 30 seconds. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Oh, it's here. It's up here. It's up here. Going down. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. Almost. 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 Here we go. Here we go. There's something right there, and I'm okay. It's daylight. Oh, thank God. Oh my God. That bar is so low, and that can't be a good thing. Oh my God. Let's play a Home on the Edge now. Set the table as if for a memorial. For each place, lay out sheets of paper instead of dishes. Choose your eyes and draw circles on each piece of paper. Oh, choose your eyes. Close your eyes. Never mind. <laughs> Close your eyes and draw circles on each piece of paper. Repeat in your mind, in different voices, round, round, while imagining how large the circles are. Sooner or later, you'll hear a voice, as clear as if someone said it in your own head. Square. Or, no, not round. Then, walk out of the room and close the door behind you. What? I, I don't, like, I know barely, I basically don't know what any of these messages mean, but they're all extremely weird and disturbing. Okay. Alright, hold on just a second, I will be right back. Alright, I am back. Let me start the day just to see if anything special happens, and then I will be right back again because I have to close the game. But I don't want to close it just now, so let's see what happens first. Okay, getting very close to the door, but I don't know if I can survive long enough given that bar. Assuming the end of the bar means my death, which is a pretty safe assumption, I think. What? I see a claw. I, I just saw, like, a claw in the corner. 
But yes, I'm gonna start this day again because I have to close the game, so once again, I will be right back. Okay, welcome back. Had to restart the game like I said. Let's begin again at that day where I think when I started it, I saw a claw. Which means I think the monster's gonna be over the house. Let's find out, shall we? See if I see that claw again. There it is! See it in the top right? Just disappeared. Okay, let me zoom out. Yep, yep, yep. It's closer. It's it's very close. It's here, basically. Okay. That bar is extremely low, so I need to go there now. Can't stop anywhere else. Can't can't do anything else. Need to go there now. And I get there by going here. I think. Do I go here? Is there a ladder? Yeah, there's a ladder. I really don't want to see what happens when that bar gets to none. Although, I think I might. I can see you. Who are you? Is he talking about the creature? Help me. Wait, are you talking to me? Is he addressing me directly? Help me? I think he might be. He lost me when I was very little, and then he lost his mind. He stopped seeing me. He? Who, who is he talking about? There's the noose. Okay. There we go. Now, out the front door. That's right, damn it, I forgot that's not the end. I need to go out the front door and... Yep. Great, I get to go out to meet that thing. I can't wait. Maybe I should check the entrance just one more time to make sure it's locked tight. Yes, let's go check one last time. If the measurements aren't lying, then these are not hallucinations. These footprints are real, and they're not mine. But who can know for sure? After all, this equipment is old. Here, vr wait, what did that say? Here, vroom, 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 come out? What? Okay, here we go. There's so many of them. Need to find my home quickly before that bar runs out. And before I go mad, too. Wait, is that- wait, wait, I think I just saw it. Is that it? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, mercifully short, let's go. Oh god, that bar is going to run out. That bar is completely going to run out before I get to the end. There's no way. Look at that. No way. What's gonna happen when that happens? Should I even try to rush? What's the point? It's definitely gonna run out before I get there. Okay. God, this is huge. It's freaking huge now. Is that a shark? The hell? I just remembered that? When exactly did that happen and why? Oh no, 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 not the crying person again. Oh god, she's above me, I have to go to her. Oh no. That's the only exit out of here. Shit. And by the way, just in case you're wondering, I can't scroll out. I can't zoom out the view while I'm moving. So I can only do it when I'm either standing still or doing an action. Okay. I could stay here forever and never go to her, but... No. I need to know. I need to know what happens. So yeah, like right now I can't. I can't zoom out. Oh god. 
Okay. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Here we go. Actually, let me wait for a little more time to pass, so just in case she takes out the usual amount of time for me, like the other creatures, I won't lose the day. Okay, that... Freeze. Freeze. No. That should be enough. Here we go. I think she just disappeared. And where is it buried? So, oh, achievement unlocked. Babysitter. What? Babysitter. And where is it buried? Somewhere close by. When I came home, there was only dirt on the bed. And also leaves, arranged in a peculiar way. Wait, where is it buried? What is it? His diary? There was dirt on the bed. And leaves. So maybe he... Maybe he sleepwalked and buried his own diary? That's why there was dirt on the bed? Because it was him? And leaves arranged in a peculiar way. Okay, well, she didn't hurt me. Thank God. And there's a spirit above me. Wonderful. And it's coming back. What? I shouldn't have turned on that light. Something was wrong in there. Actually, everything's wrong in this house. Once again, everything's different. What is real? Yeah, why did it just teleport me? What the hell is wrong in that room? Oh god, look at the bar at the top of the screen. It's almost gone. What's gonna happen? No! I'm not gonna wait here. Alright, it's coming. But I'm gonna get here first. Oh god! <laughs> Shit! Dude, I, I, I can't do anything but go up and down. I'm not going into the eye. God, that just took away more time. Okay, here we go. Good. Where's the spirit? Where did it go? Three. Look at the bar. It's almost gone. Almost, almost. Oh, boy. Oh, there it is. All right, I'm going up. I didn't turn off the light. I want to see you. The bar is almost up. The bar is almost up. Anything in this room? No. Oh great, there's something down there too. Let me go down here just to turn off the light. And right then, it was inside. Come on. Nothing in here? Just an empty room? Oh god, the bar. It, the, look at the fucking bar. I've got like 30 seconds before the bar is gone. Wait a minute. I am close. Okay, I'm gonna wait here. Just wait here in this empty room. What happens when that bar disappears? Look at it. Oh god. Oh! Can you hear me coming? Okay. A spirit just spawned. Was that because of the bar, or was that totally unrelated? I don't know, let's figure out what the bar is. Come on. I just can't do it anymore. Run down to the basement and continue suffering, or walk outside, enter the forest, and put an end to it all. Is the bar up? It's... where is it? Where's the bar? Is it still there? I don't I don't see it. What happened? It's silent. I have a terrible I have a terrible feeling. What did he say? That it's killing him in the real world while I'm sleeping, so I need to get out of here fast? Oh great. 
It's the crying woman again. He said it was killing him in the real world while he was sleeping. So it doesn't end the game. But what if I'm never going to wake up because I've died? Oh god. I wonder. Oh look at that thing behind me. Hi, bye. It's a pile of leaves with legs. Let's let's take care of it. There. I think that hurt my time. Oh. Okay. Apparently it doesn't want to be looked at. Just unlock this door while I'm here. Something in here. Please be a clock. I really want it to be a clock. It's not a clock. Let's go pay a visit to the crying woman. What if I turn on the light? Okay, she disappears. Oh, and she's back when you turn off the lights. Okay. Come closer. I'm right here. What is that? A bunch of sticks in the corner. Hmm. Hold on. Let's go visit her in the dark. Oh, Jesus Christ! What the fuck? I shouldn't have looked at her. I shouldn't have looked at her. That was a mistake. No. No. Never again. Under just leaves are its shores. Under just brambles it hides. Under just leaves it lays. Under just brambles it hides. It was you who believed in me. Wait there. I will wait here. Not. Oh, God. Go away, spirit. I, I, you gotta stay here. It came I need to wait for it to leave. Come on, where are you? Yeah, go away. She's gonna come back. I can never go down there without seeing her again. Okay, I don't know if these spirits are moving between levels now, or what. Is it gonna come up? No, okay, that one didn't move, at least not there. Wait. Don't do this. No need. Hm, there it is in the corner. Wait a minute, if I turn on the light, it's gonna... It's gonna move me somewhere. No, okay, I won't turn it on. I, I won't turn it on. Alright, this- well, shit, when I turn this on, it's gonna- yeah. Still, it's okay, it's okay, it doesn't hurt that much. It doesn't take that much time back. Look in my eyes. I don't want to look in your eyes. Okay, can I go down? I've gotta do it, I need to leave. Okay, I, I have to do this. It's gonna probably teleport me. Yep. It's okay. Gotta get past her. Actually, that was a mistake. This goes nowhere. Shit, wait, where do I... Uh... Oh, I know where I need to go. I'm just gonna leave that light on. Live wherever. Don't you do this. Live. I don't like leaving lights on, but I'm gonna leave that one on so I can go up and down these steps without seeing her. Hey there. Neat and 
greet time. Did it just say, hey there, meet and greet time? I don't want to meet the guests. No thanks. I think I just saw something above me. I mean, I know there's a spirit up there, but I think I saw something else. Okay, I'm just going to leave this light on. Yeah. Above me. I'm looking above me. I see a spirit. Alright, I'm going up. Whoa, what is... The fuck is... Floating candles? Um, Are they dangerous? Given everything in this game, I'm going to bet they're probably dangerous. Okay, I'm going to go up and I'm going to turn off the turn on the lights. Maybe that'll take care of the floating candles. Wait for the spirit to get away. Don't know what that sound was, but uh, I'm doing this. Candles are coming towards me. They want to kill me. Yep. Okay, I'm going. I can't go up there, basically. Actually, I can't leave. Really, I can go down and face her or go up and face them. Neither of which are a very good proposition. What did you just remember? He just remembered something in here, but I don't know what it was. Hold on, I might be able to go... Whoa, they're lit. I might be able to go past the candles and the spirit if I time this right. Maybe. Actually, I think I can. Let's do that, yeah. When the spirit comes back. Oh, shit. Go. Fuck. Okay, I am staying. Well, that didn't work. I'm staying right here. Okay, and we're going. Spirit's coming for me, but I'm going to go up the steps. Up the steps. Let's see if I can turn this light on first. I think I can. Don't risk it. Don't risk it. Not worth the risk. Okay. I need to wait. Free. It sounds like someone just dropped a. Oh, je Jesus! Maybe the voice is actually connect truly connected to what's happening. She said freeze, just when something was about to catch me. Just when you thought of that, it came in. Go past. Now your turn. Go seek. My turn to go seek? I don't want to seek anything you have to hide. Wait for it to go past. Maybe I do need to actually respond to her comments. Maybe they actually mean something. Okay, going past, going past. Why? Hi. Oh great, there's a bunch of them behind me, like three. Right behind you. Yes, it is. It is right behind me. She is actually, wow, she's actually saying the truth. It is right behind me. It is. Don't do this. Wait there. Wait there, no. I'm gonna do nothing she says. I'm gonna do the op try to do the opposite of everything she says. Wait there. Oh yep, yep, it wanted me to wait there. It knows where you are. It does know where I am. She's really she's truly saying what's happening here. It knows where I am. Look look at the eye. This is gonna hurt it, but I don't I don't care. Listen. Oh, I'm listening. I need a clock. Please. Damn it. It's behind me. Don't do this. Oh, I'm gonna do this. Screw you, I. I'll take the hit. There, see? It was worth it. Oh, I meant to turn that off. The light. Okay, so I need to actually listen to what she's saying. 
nothing done. I'm almost, almost through. It might be better just to stay here, but I don't think I can. No, you can't stay in one place. No way. There's a lot of things popping up, but I'm almost done. Almost done. Hey there. We can what just happened? Time. Oh, oh no. I, uh, this is going to restart the day, isn't it? Crap. Well, I, I don't understand what triggers this. Is it random or is it something I'm doing? All I did was unlock a door. Which, so far, is how this thing has always been triggered by me opening a door. I think. Maybe there's a random chance of a door being a doorway to something other than my home. Oh great, and now his eyes just turned into that as soon as he heard the creature. That's wonderful. Okay, hold on a second. Um, I'm going to be right back. All right, let's continue. Oh yes, that's right. Oh god. They're probably going to be everywhere. Do I go through the open doors or do I, do I go through the closed doors? Last time going through the closed doors didn't seem to accomplish anything except taking me to a new hallway. And going through the open doors... He's talking to himself. Going through the open doors seems to just restart the day. So, closed door. Let's go. Okay, different hallway and his eyes are normal. That's good. Not falling for the open doors. Nope. There we go. Come on, don't touch it. There we go. Whew. All right, so I'm going to go mad pretty soon here. As you can see from the things snaking across my screen. Okay, yeah, these aren't going anywhere. Nowhere useful anyway. All right, I'm going to have to go through the open doorways pretty soon. I really don't get this section of the game. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is supposed to be or what you're supposed to do. Oh god, his eyes again. Oh. Great. Fuck. Also, I'm hearing creepy piano music. Screw it, I'm going through them. There's a door. There's a door. Damn it, I hit it. This isn't going anywhere. Damn it. Just back and forth between these different hallway types. Hmm. Alright, I'm going. I don't have any more time. Whoa, what is this? What the heck? It's like random scribblings. I mean, not totally random, they seem to be related to science, like uh, equations or mathematical stuff, formulas, and... It's on some sort of a shattered ceiling, I think? Oh, I'm still here. Okay, I don't have any more time to spend here, so I'm just going to go through all the doorways, all of them. Yeah, I think I'm just restarting the freaking day. Oh. Yep, here we go again. Oh joy. I barely, barely made it through this day before. Exactly what I need. Thank you. Oops. There we go. Don't forget to turn out the lights, or it'll see you. Wow, it really... It almost seems like the game actually adjusts its difficulty based on your experience. Like, if you keep messing up or you keep dying or something or restarting the... the same day, it seems to give you a lot of clocks. 
And unless that's just a coincidence. It really doesn't seem to be, though. We shall test that. Let's see how many more clocks I get. Alright, where's the crying woman? Where is she? I don't see her. Wait, he's remembering something else. Oh, there's that helmet. Again, the diving helmet. Old school diving helmet. What did I just hear? Oh, it's it's one of those leaf creatures. Wonderful. Yeah, I don't think that's a coincidence. I'm pretty sure it's throwing me clocks, which is a good idea, actually, to reduce player frustration. Very smart. Okay. I, yep, gotta do that, and it's gonna teleport me. That's okay. I'm okay with that. I'm just gonna leave this place. God damn it, something found me. I heard footsteps. I heard footsteps sound effects and I should have paid attention to them. I didn't- I thought they were just like background noise, but no, they're not. You really have to pay attention to this game. Come on, I need more clocks, I need more clocks. That is not a clock. Do not. It just said do not, which means I will. Fuck you. Wait there. Wait there. No. No. I'm not waiting there. Okay, good. Good. Now, what's in this room? There was something. Now it's gone. Okay. Where are you? Good, it doesn't know where I am. Good, good. Alright, there's not too many unexplored rooms left. Alright, how do I get past that? Can I get past that? I have to... I don't think I can get past that. Am I going to be stuck up here for the rest of the game? Because he is blind. He is helpless because he is blind. That's what the voice just said. I can't go down there. It won't go to the right enough for me to avoid it. Just when you thought about it, it came in. Crap. Uh, yeah, I, I'm trapped. I have to wait here the rest of the game. If I can, I mean, I mean the rest of the night. Well, shit. I hear you. Oh wait, wait, did it just move up? Or is that another one? I think it just moved up. Oh, and there it is. You thought about it. And now it is inside. Let's fix this up again. I think it was already down here. Ah, oh, damn it, I want to see what's up there. Alright, forget it, forget it, forget it. I'm just gonna leave it. Where have I not explored? The front door? Have I explored the front door? Oh, no, I have not explored here, because there's the crying woman down below. Wait. And it's coming. Which means I have to go down to the crying woman. Great.
Oh, wow. It didn't uh, mess me up. Okay. Maybe it was a hint. The invisible tried to explain where to find it. Perhaps I should have saved or at least memorized those cute little... What does that say? Those cute little leaves? But then I simply didn't want to think about it. Wait, what hint? Is it talking about the, uh, the strangely ordered leaves that were left in his bed? I think that's what it's talking about. Hmm. So apparently he didn't memorize it. Well, damn. No need. No need. Does that mean I should leave? I'm gonna leave. Just when you thought about it, it came in. <gasps> okay, I'm going back down. Is there something in here? No shit. Ugh. Where are you? Go away. It won't see me if I don't turn on the light. Fuck. What is that noise? I'm gonna stay on the ladder here. I really don't want to be in the room. I'm just gonna stay on the ladder. The day's almost over. Stay put. Stay put. Stay put. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You thought about it, and now... It is inside. It is inside. I'm going back down. The day's almost over. Almost. Just end. End. End fucking end. Ten seconds. How will he go on? Ten seconds. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. It's behind me. It's behind me. Don't look. Don't look. Don't look. Okay. It's daylight. Okay. Jesus. Hmm. We are now playing... What does that say? Resettlement? It's a wish-making game. This is how you need to play it. If someone manages to wake up one hour before dawn, that person, person should declare themselves the living in their thoughts. At sunrise, the living should stand before the closed door and say out loud, The hour is at hand. It's time to get ready to go. After these words, the door should stay closed. If it doesn't work, that person is no longer the living. Okay, this ties into what I was thinking before, which is that bar ran out, and yet it didn't end the game, but he mentioned that it was killing him in the real world while he was sleeping. And this is telling me if it doesn't work, that person is no longer the living. I have a feeling I am no longer the living. Declare themselves the living in their thoughts. At sunrise, stand before the closed door and say out loud, the hour's at hand, it's time to get ready to go. Then the door should stay closed. If it doesn't work, that person is no longer the living. I think I'm dead. Oh god. Uh, here we go. Last one before the door. Or maybe this is the door, I'm not sure. I see it again. Over on the right, it's closer. Okay, well, at least I don't have to worry about that bar running out, because it's already run out. It used to sleep right here. W wait, what is it? What used to sleep right here? Hold on, what happens if I turn on one of these lights? Is it going to see me through the window? Hmm. Nothing happened. Softly, softly. It happened here, in this very forest, in this very home. Wait, what is it? What happened?
Where is it? Oh, over to the right and down. There's the noose again. Okay. What's in the corner? Something under sheets. Okay, here we go, into the forest. Um, what? I don't understand. What just happened? Uh, continue? Okay, I, I walked out the door and then I went crazy. Um, let's try going to the door first. See if I can say the words and keep it closed, maybe? Like the message said. I finally found it. There it is. My dear diary. This is the exact same cover, the very same pattern, like it was cobbled together from thick pine boards. Wait, you finally found it. Where? Like right here? You just found... What's it say? Is this a one? Achievement unlocked. Fear of a blank page. The first time we learned about the program was in the fall, about six months after the unrest. They described it as a community initiative. Most of the tenants gathered in the courtyard of our complex. No one knew what was going on. Everyone was shouting, worried, and guessing what will come next. All kinds of rumors. First time we heard about the program. The program, a community initiative. What is that talking about? Okay, well... Whoa, what the... How... Did I just activate this because I walked back to... How did this... I don't know. Two. It came down to this. They would be removing children, as if from unfit parents. For what purpose? Who knew? But against the backdrop of everything our government had done and justified in recent years, the outlook was most sinister. At that point, I decided to grab my son and escape the city to the middle of nowhere. Is this from... this is from me? I had a son? Is this... Okay, so they're taking away children. My character did say that there used to be someone small here, right? Okay, so what just activated... What just activated that note? Was that me getting close to the door? Yeah, what the heck? Every time I walk to the door, it gives me a new note. Okay. Three. First news about the program. First, the summons arrive. Or the, the summons arrives, and they announce a gathering, usually at a school. Then the door... The door knockers come. Young bastards. Like volunteers. Wearing some party insignia, they go through the complex with lists and check who shows up and who doesn't. What the hell? What is this program for? For, I'm not the only one getting clever. Everyone is getting ready to leave for somewhere. We've already been given another family's furniture to look after. Everything is changing. Parents are hiding their kids with other people. So now we have two more. I don't leave my child's side for even a minute. Even in my sleep, I hold his hand. The other children sleep with us, too. It's crowded. The world is falling apart. 
Seems to me this situation is headed for civil war. I'm trying to think about this and how it fits into what I'm what I've seen so far. I'm not I'm noticing some things that are connected to what I've done here. Like talking about uh, well children, which is already mentioned there used to be, you know, there used to be someone small in here, right? Okay. He said he didn't. Uh, there was something he didn't want to remember, like something had been taken, or someone, or something like that. His kid, his son, maybe. And he mentions parents are hiding their kids with other people. Well, obviously, hiding is a big part of this. This is a hide and seek, after all, right? Maybe this is a nightmare inspired by the things that have happened to him. The hide and seek with the. People trying to get their children into the program. And also, um, we've already been given another family's furniture to look after. Maybe that's why it's so hard to remember what's in my house. Maybe that's why it's always changing because my house is always changing because of the new furniture. New people and new furniture constantly moving in and out and whatnot. I, I don't know. Okay, give me another. Five. Achievement unlocked. Busy with paperwork. <laughs> I had a nightmare that our turn came. We were led to the school, shoved into what used to be the gym. My son and I sat in a cell with a small barred window. I tried to push him through the opening. From the other side came shouts that any kid they catch would be taken unconditionally. There is no suffering worse than this feeling of helplessness. Oh my god, how many are there? Seven. It's past the time when I should leave this apartment, but concern for the children stops me. Stumbling around like a sleepwalker. There's another key term that's connected to what's been happening so far. Stumbling around like a sleepwalker. I don't recognize a thing. That's also connected to what I've been seeing. He doesn't recognize, he doesn't remember what's around. They took the little ones. I haven't seen them for at least two days. I suddenly found another child in a corner. Whose is it? No one knows. It sits in the corner, wrapped up in a blanket. Doesn't show his face. Doesn't say a word. Sometimes I think it may be a girl. It sits in the corner, wrapped up in a blanket. I think it may be a girl. Hold on, okay, so I've... I have seen a crying, a crying woman or a crying girl, I'm not sure which, in the corner. The thing that looked around at me. And it gave, it gave me an achievement called Babysitter when I did that, right? And I've also seen a girl out in the woods. And, remember the room that the clock is in? I said, what's that in the, in the corner? It looks like it's something covered by a blanket. Hmm. Eight. I won't drink any more. All I can think about is my little, invisible one. Doesn't eat or speak. I'm not pressing? Don't even want to watch? Let it keep playing hide and seek. The child is like clothes with nothing inside. Doesn't take food. But all those kids, they forage for themselves. Somehow, little by little, they've learned to look after themselves. Most likely all I need to do now is just love her, and eventually, She'll show herself. What? My, my mind is exploding at this point. I'm trying to fit these pieces together. There's obvious connections between all of this, but... How does it come together? Just love her and eventually she'll show herself. Let it keep playing hide and seek. That's exactly what it's doing. It's played in. It's playing hide and seek. And it's seeking me. And it's the voice of a little girl. Love her, and eventually she'll show herself. How do I love her? What? 
There's so many themes here that are connected, but I don't, I can't put it together into a concrete picture. Nine. Maybe it's a boy after all? It started to make little noises. From inside his blanket cocoon, odd squeaks and croaks. It still turns away, but at least now it's reacting to me. It seems like it's really invisible. It tries to reach out and touch me from time to time. But there are no hands there, only emptiness. Maybe she escaped from the program? Is that what they're doing to our kids? I shouldn't be thinking about it. I don't want to. Maybe she escaped. They made her invisible? Experimenting? Oh my god! How long is this? They're gonna have a novella here pretty soon. Found the bedding on the invisible's bed, crumpled and tossed about, as if in disgust. I gently asked why. It only croaked out something about how the bed smells bad. I took it out for a walk. Oh, hold on, I just want to stop here for a second. Why is he talking about it as if it's a thing? I took it out for a walk like it's a dog? That is really weird. It's a dry autumn, lots of scents in the air. We picked berries and leaves, and I asked which smells it likes. Silence. It accepts nothing. And then it lets me know that it wants to get something to show me. I let it go. The city is almost deserted now. Why not let it run around a bit? It, it, it. He keeps saying it, as if it's a thing. As if it's a thing. Okay, why the fuck did that light just go off? That That is disturbing. Let's turn that back on. You're afraid, and that's why you want to fall back asleep. You need to push forward and wake up. Hmm. Eleven. There is no child in the house. Achievement unlocked, weaving the story. There is no child in the house, but on the bed I found what it brought back for me. Strange selection. A few shriveled maple leaves, all mixed up with wet dirt, as if it scooped them up from the ground in cupped hands and carried them home folded in its clothes. Now all these rags have to be washed. Whether I want to or not, I'll have to see what's hidden inside. But I think I can already guess. We became strangely close in the weeks that we spent together. So that's what left the dirt and the leaves. It was the... the it that he keeps calling it. It. Is there more? I think that's it. Okay. Now what? Do I go out the front door and risk losing my mind again? Hold on, I'm going to turn on the lights everywhere. I'm going to turn on all of the lights. It's not here either. Okay. used to sleep right here. That, that, yeah, okay, that's what he's talking about. It. That's it. It used to sleep right here. It used to sleep in the observatory. Interesting. Let's head up towards the clock. Softly, softly. Okay, I am back. Did I already repair this room? No, I didn't. Fewer and fewer days left. No kidding. It almost seems like there's zero days left. It happened here, in this very forest, in this very home.
we planted the forest to hide one tree. Planted the forest to hide one tree. What? Again, all this talk about hiding, about hiding the children from the program. And there's some leaves on the ground. I just realized, maybe the creature is the program. Maybe it is the menace coming to take away the children. A looming threat ever, ever closer. It's very important that Sunrise finds you in a fully restored home. Your house is always much larger than it seems. Fully restored home. So I need to restore my home. Need to restore it. Your house is always much larger than it seems. Okay, so I was missing something. Larger than it seems. Better open it yourself. Wait, what? Is it saying don't use the clock? I think it's saying don't use the clock. Okay. How? I mean, the thing said you should um, you should say certain words in front of the in front of the locked door, right? But uh, I can't seem to do that. Your house is larger than it seems. But where can I go that I didn't see before? Fully repaired a home. How can I repair it? Like, turn on all the lights? They just... They go off at random. I don't think I can actually have them all on at the same time. It's just not really possible. They disappear too fast. It's larger than it seems. Open it yourself. I can't. I have a feeling that if I do the same thing I did before, I'm just gonna go crazy again. What do I do? I'm looking for like secret doorways, but... But I don't know. Can I just go back to sleep? Nope. Well, at least I can with the, with the light off. Maybe if I turn it on, I can. Nope. Just gonna keep repairing the lights. Maybe I can get them all on at... The, ooh, the guests almost never kill. They only bring you back because you haven't finished yet. Actually, might be possible to get all the lights on. I've almost got them. If I can get this in one more, I will have them all on, but what's that going to do? You need to tidy up the house. Time to welcome the guests. Okay, how do I welcome the guests? Aren't you supposed to put something on the dining room table or something? Okay, that's... they're all on. Welcome! They're not coming. I need to tidy up the house. How? I don't get it.
How can I do anything other than turn on and off the lights? I'm wondering if there's something I can interact with. Oh, there goes a light. If there's something I can interact with that I haven't realized. I'm trying to interact with everything. Alright, I'm going to explore the house one more time, and if I can't find anything, I'm just going to do the clock again. not a dream. This is really your own actual home. Tidy up the house. How? I don't get it. I really don't get it. Alright. Well. It's probably time to use the clock again. There's that thing in the corner. There we go, I just used it. That's probably gonna swing open, right? There it goes. But isn't it just going to kill me again? Check the rooms again on my way over there. I really have a feeling this is going to do the exact same thing it did before. Isn't it just going to drive me mad again? Here we go. But I've already had this dream, and not too long ago. The hour's at hand. It's time to get ready to leave. It's time to get ready to leave. Have I not already done that? Is he telling me to go back? Okay, it's time to get ready to leave. Once again, this is um, fueling into the idea that what has happened is that monster is basically the program bearing down on us, trying to steal my son or something, trying to steal something, one of the children, and that I'm getting ready to pack up and leave to escape from it. So do I just go out again? No. What the hell? I don't get it. I don't understand. What am I missing? Alright, if I go to the front door again, am I going to get those notes once again? I used to sleep right here. I finally found it. Yeah, a diary. Yep, there's one. Two. Three. Should I get them all? Is there any point? What if I leave them? Five. Five. 
Wait a minute. Did that go from five to seven? Where, where's six? Hmm. That's suspicious. And that's it. Softly, softly. I really don't understand. Use it again. And if I go to the front door, is he going to say something again? I need to get ready to leave. How do I get ready to leave? Can I pack my things? Do I need to have it show itself to me? Like he said, if I... Uh, what did he say if you... I don't remember exactly what he said. But like, if you treat it well, it will show itself to me, or something like that? I need to get it to come to me to leave? But, I mean, how would I do that? I have no idea. Not a freaking clue. But if I had the stream not too long ago, the hour is at hand, it's time to get ready to leave. Okay? I would love to leave! How? I don't get it. Am I missing something, or is this some sort of a bug? I don't understand. What if I turn off every single light in the house? Would that help anything at all? Why would it? That doesn't make any sense. Why would that help? Okay. The various notes. And things have said I need to leave. I need to patch up my home. I need to make it ready for the visitors. And stuff like that. But I don't seem to actually be able to do anything. If I go outside, I'm just going to go crazy again, and it's going to be game over. Probably. It's a fair assumption to make at this point, I think. So... So what? I... There isn't a single thought in my brain as to what I could possibly do. Game over, again. I don't understand. I mean, at this point, what can I even try? I can't seem to interact with anything. Going to the front door before you use the clock gets you the diary entries. Going there after you use the clock simply leaves it open and I don't think you get the diary. So... So what? I mean, 
If you look at the footprints, it seems like they go to the wall, almost as if you could continue, but I can't. There's just, there's just nothing here. Right behind the clock are two flip-flops, just like mine. Interesting, but it doesn't help me. There's nothing in here. I don't get it. I don't get it. I literally can't think of a single thing to try. Nothing. Nothing. I've had all of the lights on. I've had none of the lights on. I've gone out before touching the clock. Or, well, tried to go out. Couldn't open it. I've tried to look for interactable items. I've gone out after getting all the diary entries, etc, etc. The thing is, this game really doesn't give you that many ways to interact with the world. So, there's very little I can actually do to combine, you know, to make combinations. And he goes mad again. What? I... At this point, I'm thinking three things. Or, I'm thinking what's happening is one of three things. Either there is a solution to this, and it's just very strange and esoteric, and that's why I don't get it. Or, I mean, I guess I could just be an idiot as well, but yeah, there's some sort of a solution to this that I just don't get. Or, or, you can get yourself to a place in the game where you simply cannot finish it. Maybe because the bar ran out. But if that's true, that would be horrible game design, because it would be nice if the game actually told me that I screwed myself over rather than leaving me to wonder whether I'm doing something wrong or not, because it doesn't look like the game's actually ended. It's just that I can't seem to continue properly. So I... So I seriously doubt that I've completely screwed myself over here, because I think the game would have told me that in some way. Or... Wait, what was the third one? I've already lost it. Oh yes, or it's a bug. One of three things. I don't get it, or I've screwed myself over, or it's a bug. I can't think of a single thing to try. Nothing. So? Okay. I heard a weird noise and the light went out in here. Does that mean anything? Is there any connection? Nope. I think that's just the typical random weird happenings. It's not here either. I know! The diary's in front of the door. Hmm. You used to sleep right here. Okay, there, I can think of one more thing, actually, but... It's, it doesn't make any sense at all, so I seriously doubt it's a solution. The solution is this. You read part of the diary and then open the door. Okay, there's one page. So let's leave it. And then open the door and see what happens. I don't see why that would do anything at all, but it's something. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna have to look up a walkthrough. I 
All right, there we go. I don't know. The game appears to be communicating to me, telling me that there should be some way to solve this. Those messages saying I need to prepare for the guests. I need to fix my home. I need to patch it up. I need to prepare to leave. But I can't think of anything to do to do that. So... I'm going to have to look up a walkthrough. Alright, well, I guess I'm going to end this episode here. And hopefully when I come back, I have the solution, if there is one. So yeah, I hope you have enjoyed so far, and I will be back soon.